Hey guys, this is VOG Weekly News for the week of 30th of August 2015. It's gonna be the end of the month, bitches. My name is Rave, and this is. Wait, where's Fish? Fish is busy doing something Wait, what the hell? Yeah, he's. He has gone to the sea for a week? Yeah. God damn it. Oh well, on to the news. First up, Microsoft responds to the Xbox One mini rumors. Phil Spencer came out bluntly saying no. That also doesn't mean it's not gonna happen, but all he says that it might happen in the future. And coming up next is the Star Wars spec for Minecraft is finally out on the PlayStation version of Minecraft. And I'm really quite excited for that. And uh, you know, Nintendo is also now allowing um, people to, you know, just developers make the entire Amiibo series, if they want to, you know, if they want to make their own Amiibos, they can go ahead and do it. Which is, to me, is, I think it's really great. You know, I've really enjoyed the hell out of it. Shit, I don't like it. I don't know what the point of it. And then coming up next is Assassin's Creed news. Michael Fassbender's Assassin's Creed costume for the movie has been revealed. The costume looks very different from any of the characters in the Assassin's Creed franchise because the movie will introduce a new character called Kalen Lynch. It's announced that Kalen Lynch is a new character that is in Italy and will have some kind of connection to Destiny Mouse. And then more on Assassin's Creed news. Assassin's Creed Syndicate will arrive on the PC version one month later than the console version. The reason being is that now we have more stuff and we want to make the PC version right and uh, they're going to make a PC port that is for the PC, not just a port from the console version. Which is, I think, is kind of cool because after what happened in the Arkham Knight, a lot of PC Steam fans are like, God damn it, make a new, make a proper PC port. They're just like, uh, alright, we'll do it. So they're gonna do that, which is really cool. I love that kind of stuff. So it's cool that we saw this great effort for that kind of stuff. And then GTA 5 Rockstar Editor is coming to the consoles in September in an all new update bundle. The update includes the Rockstar Editor and all the new features too, which is awesome. Still not known what else is going to be in the bundle, but you know, according to YouTuber Dom is Live, the update might contain lowriders and it might be actually called the low life update compared to the high life update. The release date according to the same YouTuber Dom is Live is either the 1st or 2nd of September, which is, I think it's quite near, right? It's about uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, around there, which is cool. And then, you know, moving away from Grand Theft Auto, we got some WWE news. Yes, WWE 2K16 will include 100 creator wrestler slots compared to 25 from last year will also contain more improvements like cloth simulation, cancel pin animation, and 160 superstar models to make this the biggest WWE roster for any WWE game till date. And also there will be many more features you can check it out at WWE2K Dev or WWE2K Channel. And then coming up also the Mortal Kombat X for the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 has been cancelled. God damn it. But you know, after so much delays, probably sure one of brothers games cancelled, but you know, it sucks, but it's okay, you know. I mean, if it's not gonna come out after so long, I guess there's no point in it, you know. And then also Borderlands movie has been confirmed. Uh, Lionsgate and a Marvel Studios co-founder is confirmed to be producing it. I'm super excited, I hope you guys are. And uh, I think that's pretty much it for the news of this week. And uh, you know, what do you think? You know, do you think of the news for the week? Let us know in the comments below. Also, if you like us, subscribe and hit that thumbs up button. We do really appreciate that. Thank you guys, Eugene and fishes. I hope he's back next week. See you guys. Bye.